Hey guys, Brian delivers you the goods here. I'm hitting you up again for a surprising video, and this is for the top 10 Bring Me the Horizon songs that I actually like. So I'm gonna go through my top 10 Bring Me the Horizon tracks and let you know what my favorite ones were. At number 10, it's uh, gonna be uh, It Never Ends. This song was really good. Uh, guitar work and drums were great. And Ollie's uh, loud, normal screams in it were pretty good. I guess it talks about him suffering in a way. I don't know the whole background behind the story of the song, but I know that the song was pretty good in my books and it was an enjoyable track at number nine it's a uh, mantra sure this one wasn't their top success for the album because it can be repetitive listening through this track but the song was still really good, and it gets you a little pumped up for their new record coming out on January 25th, which I hope to God it's really good. But I won't know until January 25th. But uh, Mantra was a great track. Very culty-ish with the background behind it. And the breakdowns in the song were really good with the choruses. I love the lyric before, the truth will set you free, it'll piss you off. That's one of my favorite lines in that song. Uh, and yeah, the depth of the song was really enjoyable. And the meaning behind it is, it's just out there mostly. But the song itself was an enjoyable hit, and it's one of my favorite songs so far. Number eight is uh, going to be Doomed. Uh, this track was kind of weird in a way. The lyrics behind it are a little weird and... The tone in Ollie's voice in this song was kind of strange, but still really good. Uh, but the song itself was a pretty good opener for the That's the Spirit uh, album to open the record. And it brought a good sensational vibe in a way to get you to enjoy the track mostly. But I enjoyed the track, and it was, I wouldn't say a masterpiece, but it was a good track. Number seven is, hmm, number seven. I would say Chelsea Smile. This one is just an anthem, kind of throw it in your face kind of song. Like, this song gets up in your face, mostly. And it's just, like, a cr crazy screams. And a lot of screamo, mostly. <laughs> Pretty much blasted my ears out, mostly. <laughs> but the song itself was an enjoyable track, and I really liked it. Uh, number six is going to be Throne. This one was a badass track. It would have made it to my number one, but I think it's... Sorry about the laughing out there. Um, I just... it, it's nothing. Uh, yeah, the track itself was a real enjoyable hit. And... I love all these pitch screams in the song. They're really good. And 
There's not much to talk about. This song was a real enjoyable hit. I love the electronic work in this song. And uh, the lyrics behind it were great. And I love the breakdown of the chorus where he's like, Every scar will build my throat. With that pitch up there. When you hear the electronics building in with his singing, when they're, he's singing Throne, that's really good. At number five, True Friends. This one, at first I wasn't crazy about it, but after hearing it a few more times, it's an enjoyable track. It talks about how this friend uh, backstabbed him and betrayed him. And uh, that he can't trust him anymore. Or trust that friend anymore. But the song itself was an enjoyable hit. I'm sorry if I'm being a little repetitive and saying the same things over and over. But there's nothing much to talk about with these songs. I really enjoyed them. At number four, we have... Uh, Number four, I would say uh, Sleepwalking. This one was a favorite. Uh, I love Ollie's screams in this, his loud scream in the song. It makes the song fit well when he's breaking down the chorus of the song. And the build up with that uh going up to the chorus is really good and a real enjoyment it was a f one of my favorite tracks by them number three shadow moses this one is a really good hit uh i love the part where they're like this is sabotage where they mention the name of the album in the song. That's pretty good. Number two is... Uh, number two... Can You Feel My Heart? And that scream in that song was great. I gotta breeze through this quickly. So drum roll for this one. Number one is Wonderful Life. I know this, I gave this a 4.5 out of 5, but it deserves a 5 out of 5 now. It's an amazing track. It talks about how we live everyday life and how we have to breeze through the boring spots in life. And just do our everyday thing. Go to work mostly. Eat breakfast. Da da da. It's just the same old crap. <laughs> But definitely comment below. Let me know what your top 10 favorite Bring Me The Horizon tracks are. Tap a like on this video if you liked it. Subscribe to my channel if you want to. I will be returning to you momentarily for a promo video for the top 20 best songs of 2018 that I'll be releasing. So thanks for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. And I'll see you in my next one.